Hello. In this lesson, we are going to look at an intermediate sketch tool called Convert Entities. Now, this particular tool is a big time saver. But before we get into how this works, let's talk about what we have on the screen. On the screen, you see a 3D model and a reference plane up to this point. We have not covered either of these. Unfortunately, I was required to create a 3D model and a reference plane in order to discuss Convert Entities. So, let's begin. What is Convert Entities? Convert Entities allows you to take existence geometry and project it onto your current sketch plan. So, what is the benefit of that? Well, it saves you time redrawing geometry which already exists in the model. Let's take a look at how to do it. I'm going to start a new sketch. Now I'm going to create my new sketch on this plan 1. So select plan 1. And then I will go to convert entities. Assemble property manager opens. I will go back to the screen and select this edge of the part. I want to bring this edge into my current sketch. I roll the model and grab this back edge. Notice, into the property manager I have all four edges. I'm going to go ahead and click the green check mark and notice that profile was projected onto my current sketch plan. Also notice that all of the lines are black and it says fully defined for this sketch. However, we don't see any smart dimensions and we don't see any geometric relations that we recognize. We just see this four here that we haven't seen before. These relations are called an edge. Now, what does that mean? Well, that simply means if you update this original geometry that this sketch was created from, this sketch here will update with it. So, let's give that a try. I'm going to close out of the current sketch. I'm going to go back to my property manager. Expand the post extrude 1. And then edit the sketch that we used to create the original profile. I will edit the sketch. Let's change just number here to 100. And we will also change a center to center distance to 100. The original geometry updates. So close out of the sketch. You will see the sketch created on this reference plane is also updated. To verify that, I can go to a top view and you will see the two are on top of one another. So that was all for this video. Thank you for watching. Please don't forget to like and subscribe to get more. Have a nice day and until the next video.